Hi, my name is Mark van den Borre. I'm a long-time free software and open hardware enthusiast. I volunteer for the DIYBookscanner.org project and I run my own tiny little company DIYBookscanner.eu. Uh, today I'm going to show you my very simple, robust, fast workflow for scanning books with the DIY book scanner. So, what do we have here? First, my laptop running stock Ubuntu uh, with two additional packages PTP cam for triggering the cameras and GPhoto 2 for downloading from the cameras in a reliable way. Then we have the DIY book scanner. Notice how this is our uh, research prototype where we constantly make minor modifications. Uh, you'll notice it's unpainted. Our final kits come uh, painted matte black, with, which is much better for the uh, optical properties, less reflection. Uh, a minor difference from many other setups is that we have a USB foot pedal as part of our setup. So, I just run my very simple book scanning application. The cameras get all their settings from the application. They zoom, they set to record mode. You hear pling, they are ready to scan. I push my book against the scanner, against the glass plate and press the foot pedal two cameras get triggered, turn the page, same thing all over, and the pictures get saved to the SD cards inside the cameras. Now, when the application notices 15 seconds without the cameras being triggered, without me pressing the foot pedal, um, it beeps, it starts downloading the images from the SD cards inside the cameras to the computer. It separates them into two directories one for left, one for right. It deletes all the images from the cameras and we are done. And then I can start post-processing it with ScanTailor and similar software. This was it. If you would like to stay up to date on evolutions and revolutions in the book scanning world, uh, please subscribe to our newsletter at DIYBookScanner.eu. Thank you.